Hi, today we're gonna take a look at how to convert a whole number to a fraction. It's a piece of cake, I promise. In the first example, we need to convert 5 to a fraction. And the easiest way to convert a whole number to a fraction is by putting 1 as a denominator. Therefore, 5 is equivalent to 5 over 1. Never forget that in a fraction, like this one, the top number is the numerator and the bottom number is the denominator. Nice! In the second example, we will convert 9 to a fraction. And we already know that the easiest way to convert a whole number to a fraction is by putting 1 as a denominator. 9 becomes the numerator of a fraction where the denominator is 1. To check the answer, just remember that we can also see a fraction as a division. Yep, and 9 divided by 1 equals 9, our original number. Now pay attention to the following question. What would happen if we need to convert a whole number to a fraction with a specific denominator? For example, what would happen if we need to convert 3 to a fraction with denominator 5? Well, in that case, first we multiply 3 by 5 and then we divide this product by 5. 3 times 5 equals 15. Finally, we keep the denominator the same. So 3 is equivalent to 15 fifths. Perfect! In the last example, we're going to convert 7 to a fraction with denominator 6. So first, we multiply 7 by 6, and finally, we divide this product by 6. 7 times 6 is 42, and then we keep the denominator the same. So 7 is equivalent to 42 sixths. To check the answer, just remember that we can also see a fraction as a division. And 42 divided by 6 equals 7, our original number. That's all for today. If you want to learn more about fractions, check out this playlist. See you next time and have a good one. Bye!